Thank you. Thank you very much. Good morning, everyone, again. Uh, my talk is about China's uh, lunar programs and the International Lunar Research Station. Uh, here are the four parts of my presentation. Next slide, please. First, uh, next slide, please. Yes, yes. Here are the four parts of my presentation. First, China's lunar exploration program. Second, proposal of ILRS. Third, legal principles. And finally, about international collaboration models of lunar station. As we know, China's lunar exploration program consists of three stages, orbiting, landing, and retaining. After that, we plan to establish lunar station through international cooperation. Next, please. Uh, next, please. This slide this slide shows the six missions starting from 2024, Chang'e 6, Chang'e 7, and Chang'e 8 will be lent to carry out polar exploration missions. This will be the first phase of construction of the lunar stations. China's lunar exploration program have made much progress. So we have put forward the initiation of construction of lunar station since 2016. Next, please, next. Uh, PPT. Yes. China. Yes, yes, yes. As, yes, yes, okay, it's okay. As we know, aerospace engineers have dreamed of long-term lunar residence in the 1916s and the 1917s. Soviet scientists proposed engineering plans for a long-term lunar base. And the idea of lunar base was impossible due to technical limitation. Now, when NASA proposed the Artemis program, no one touched the capabilities of human space technology of realize the dreams. China. Uh, based on the understanding of the history and the loss of human exploration of the moon, we think that the definition of ILRS means a set of complex research facilities needed to can be constructed on the surface and on the orbit of the moon. This will need the involvement of international partnership. The facility are designed for the multi-purpose scientific research activities, including exploration and use of the moon, moon-based observation, for material research experiments, and technology verification. China, please, next, please. Construction of lunar station consists of three stages. Recognition, construction, and utilization. Recognition consists of Chinese Chang'e 4, Chang'e 6, and Chang'e 7. Russians 
Luna 25, 26, 27, and the potential missions of our partners. Construction consists Chinese Chang'e 8, Russians Luna 28, potential missions of our partners. On the stage of digitalization, objectives are those parties. Next, please. And the first task we face is the legal basis and the principles of cooperation. The exploration and use of our space, including the moon and the earth celestial bodies, should be exclusively for the peaceful proposal. The out space treaty provides the basic framework of international space law, including the following principles. The exploration and use of out space should be carried out for the benefit and the in the interesting of our countries and should be provides of all my hand, my hand. Art space should be free for exploration and use by all states. Art space is not subject to national appro appropriation by claim of sovereignty, by means of use of occupation and by any other means and so on. Next, please. Shine. Uh, Shine. Yes. Next, next, Shine. Participants should agree on some basic common principles. For example, free for exploration and use of space, openness and uh, Inclusiveness, IRS were open to the world and open to all countries to participate in out space exploration or to benefit from the exploration of out space. Win-win cooperation. The participating countries were can coordinated their exploration programs and from the joint exploration objectivities in order to maximize exploration results. The exploration and use of art space for peace proposal, equality and fairness. The international rights and the obligations. Registration, Jerry's fiction and operation, Extens extensive con consultation. Participants need to share the scientific data with other parties, the public and the international scientific community in due course. Exchange of information and the data. The exchange should be based on the principle of necessity. In intellectual property is a principle is effective reciprocal protection of background intellectual property rights. Based on those principles, in accordance of the principles of extensive consultation, joint contrib contribution, and shared benefits, we are conducting international cooperation. 
the comparison models looks like this. Government-led combination of programs, scientific cooperation, commercial cooperation, NGO and scientific institutions and the industry entities is also welcome to join the international lunar station. Yeah. And thank you very much for listening.